the pendulum is starting to swing. This is a video produced by the organization Keep America Safe, run by former Vice President Cheney's daughter, Liz Cheney. The video has made quite a stir. It criticizes lawyers at the Justice Department for wanting to have military tribunals instead of civilian trials for terrorism detainees. Earlier, I spoke with legal correspondent John Schwartz about it. The accusation is that these, uh, these lawyers, and there are uh, seven to nine of them, but, but they call them the Al-Qaeda Seven, uh, are somehow conflicted, that they are, that these are people who have worked on detainee cases and therefore they have a conflict of interest. And the strong suggestion is they don't have the best interest of the United States at heart. And uh, the reaction, of course, has been huge, not just from the people who you would expect, the, 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 um, the sort of liberal uh, left side of the, of the spectrum where um, anything that a Cheney says is probably going to get a reaction. But also, but also from the other side, right? But also, right, what's, what's been emerging since early this week is, uh, is that conservatives, especially uh, many conservatives who are in the legal profession, conservatives who are legal theorists, uh, are also offended because they say, you can't do that to a lawyer. You can't tar a lawyer with, with the person he represents because the question of representation is a fundamental principle. It's a fundamental constitutional principle. Why do you think she did this? Well, I can't get inside her head, but it seems to me that um, part of this is the continuing attack on the Obama administration's Justice Department uh, and continuing to underscore the claims that these people are soft on terrorism, the flap over whether um, Khalid Sheikh Mohammed would be tried in civilian courts or under a military right. tribunal. It's all part of that continuing thrust. But at the same time, it's also an attack on individuals.